now and now, we, and now this is really cool. We have Riku in the party. Yeah, I love this. Uh, oh, I, just, I just noticed his left hand's bandaged. Yeah. Hmm. Huh. Anyways, let's take, look, let's take a look at him. Oh, wait, yeah, steal his items. Right to the door, oh, yeah. of course. Yeah, that's a really cool keyblade. And you're giving us all these. I still have I still have actual keychain in the form of Wave on. <laughs> nice. Oh wait, you have more. Yeah, it's just Luckily, it's the of the list. Yeah. Uh. Okay. You know what? I actually want to put something on Riku later. Hmm. Um. I think this is. Fine, item boost off. Item boost off. Item boost. Uh. Yeah. Because uh, mm. we went on hyper with the thing. Hmm. Defender? And, uh, I don't know. Because There's... second chance and once more stay, no matter what. Because mm. that's the thing, we might need him a bit, especially for the last part. Yeah. Defender, I guess? I don't know. The defender's not as important. Wait. Oh yeah, item boost is the other thing. Oh, now with journal, let's finish up. <laughs> with the silence. It's kind of spooky. But, you know. Oh, there's more. Hmm. There's more. Look. Character files and character links and. Uh... No, I mean for the answer. Of course, there's more. Oh. Hmm. Right. Eleven. This is me or. You. I was reunited with an old friend at Castle Oblivion, but was unable to disclose my identity. If he knew the situation, he would likely try to stop me from carrying out my revenge. As much as I would dearly love to converse with him as in the old days, that is now but a hopeless dream. My friend has been fighting in the realm of darkness. Most likely he found his way there through Tra Traverse Town. I like how the, uh, Traverse Town has been name dropped uh, a few times in the in the journal itself. It's like, you don't actually go there, which is kind of funny. Wait, find his way rare through Traverse Town. Uh, like hmm. Castle Oblivion, that village also rests in the cleft between light and dark. It consists of the remnants of worlds whose hearts have been stolen by the Heartless. It is, it is where those who have barely escaped the, uh, the destruction of their worlds eventually find themselves. This realm between... Is quite unstable, with corridors of darkness appearing from time to time. Whenever a world disappears, some of its inhabitants must arrive here through these corridors. Surely Sora traveled these same corridors of darkness when he first came to Traverse Town. It seems my friend, fighting in the realm of darkness, appeared in Castle Oblivion through a corridor of darkness constructed by Organization 13. <laughs> <laughs> now I got you doing it. <laughs> uh, my new ally, Riku, has... A also affected his return via one of these corridors. He swore to me he would give his all for his best friend, uh, for his best friend Sora. In fact, Sora's memories have been slow to return. Thus, I have asked Riku to bring me another, another, uh, to bring me another Sora, his nobody. Sora in, is indispensable. Indis, uh, indis, indispensable. If I am to, <laughs> to achieve my goal. I require the Keyblade wielding hero to fly through the Realm of Light and defeat Organization 13. Oh, so, wait a minute. What are you on? I want to, you said Traverse Town is a place between the light and the dark. It, it's like, is it like meant to be part of the realm, realm between, between? Like, I guess that makes sense because. Oh, oh, Maddie's here. Oh. Hi. Hi. Random map. I'm so tired. Because <laughs> <laughs> we just, we, you're just in time because we just got Riku in the team. <laughs> <laughs> okay, but we're finishing up reading the answer reports and we're doing it. So I, it, this is the one's mine to read. <laughs> yeah, you can see it, right, Maddie? Yeah, I can see it. I am right. so tired. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Apart from Namine, nobody's retained their memories of their time as humans, but Sora's nobody, Roxas, has lost Sora's memories. This is likely because Sora's time as a Heartless was short, having recovered his heart and returned to his human form soon after leaving behind Roxas, his nobody. 
It would seem Roxas is much like Namine. Namine is Kyrie's nobody, but came into being so- via Sora's body and soul. Likewise, oh, yeah. <laughs> whatever. <don't> <laughs> really? <laughs> uh, likewise, Roxas is Sora's nobody, but was left behind because Sora's heartless regained human form using Kyrie's heart instead of his own. It may be that Sora's memories are slow to return because the half of him that is Roxas is still lacking. I must convert Roxas into Data and return him to Sora. As a member of Organization 13, <laughs> it was exceedingly difficult to bring Roxas in. Having lost to Roxas once, Riku laid everything on the line and used the power of darkness in their second battle, only just managing to bring Roxas back with him. But Organization 13 <laughs> grows ever nearer. Here, Twilight Town, is where Roxas was reborn as a nobody. This is where Roxas first encountered Organization 13 and joined its ranks. They are bound to search this place thoroughly. First, I shall convert all of Twilight Town into data and construct a world duplicate in Sora's memories. That's where I shall place it. Roxas... Go ahead. Uh, yeah, I was just saying, like that's uh, what we were going for in, at the start of the game. Yeah. I shall place Roxas within that world to live out his days and regain those memories. There is little time. The organization schemes must be making steady progress as well. Oh, you buggy, you bit me! What the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> my cat! Like, no, wait, were you holding that in the whole time? And here yeah, he is! And here he is! Yeah! Yeah! <laughs> <laughs> uh. Memora, where the fuck is my long haired Riku? I'm pissed! Where is he? <laughs> He's right there. Uh, we're talking about Kingdom Hearts 3. Hi! Alright. Uh, so I actually right. put a dick. Yeah. Yep. And this is just small story stuff, isn't it? Just gonna brew it, la la la. Uh, so many long paragraphs. Alright, let's get moving. I love Why Donald. Don- <laughs> Why Donald? I always bring Goofy <laughs> because Donald's practically <laughs> useless. Lucky. I don't know. Honestly. Um. Man, Riku is tall. Holy shit! I, I never realized how tall he actually was. Yeah. Oh god, you took when he was when he was in the anthem form. <laughs> yeah, but the, 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 this is a, a limit. I I love this because it's just like so on uh, Riku like. Uh, combining their powers into one, and it's so cool. Light and darkness. All of them. Tango, what are you staring at me for? I kind of find you like that. A bad, um... Me and, um... Of your, of what? Um, in World That Never Was, the... What, what's that called when you go into the thing and use, like, a... Yeah. ...ability? Uh... Like, the top barrel crown in Travis Town. Or like the combat thing in, um, in Phantom of the Gears. I'm not sure what you're talking about. Like, you dive down the button and then do like a special attack or something like that? Hmm. I don't remember. Uh. <laughs> oh, cool. Um, what's more freak you can do dark or you can hit the triangle by the right time, you can do dark for it, and sometimes you can even have him run straight to you to do a shield. Yeah. Yeah, Riku is pretty much like he's that typical party member if like in, t- in terms of RPG standards, he's that one party member that, that uh, I'm gonna I'm gonna talk about um Bioware specifically because um, is it like the kind eight? of guy who's like end of the game power, really powered up character? Yeah, kind of like, um, I'm gonna say like Fallout 4, like McCready. His skill that you get for like pursuing a friendship with him or romance is like one of the best ones in the entire game. Well, I think the term is 11th hour ranger. Yeah, those Pipers too, but um, yeah. going back to Bioware, Bioware really quick, um, just... He's just that he's just that one character that is like defensive towards the protagonist, will go and try and help them, and that sometimes happens with uh Bioware party members, especially with um yeah. how close you can get to them. Like Dragon Age Inquisition. Um 
Or even Dragon Age 2, when you like pursue friendships or romances with your companions and like you fall in battle, they get really fucking upset. <laughs> they get really upset. Or like, I guess with the nice. Persona team and all that. So, like when you get hit, like, you know, it's like, it's like that, it's like the Him Daisy comic. Uh, Yosuke and you are now best friends. Yosuke will now die. <laughs> <laughs> but, but, um. It's pretty much like that. Um, my favorite is uh, Cole from Dragon Age Inquisition. He's kind of like a ghost, but not really. But um, he, he, he'll, he'll like he'll like freak out about you like falling in the middle of battle because he's like a ghost and he like can he doesn't like people hurting, so he tries to fix the hurt. Uh, That's his character and it's nice. like nifty. Fix the hurt. What does that remind me of? Oh, it reminds me of Recoded. Oh, he, yeah, yeah. Fix the hurt. Okay. No, Tigger, you can't have oh. my belt. No. <laughs> no, I, it, no, Tigger really hates Namora, so. Oh, Tigger hates Namora. <laughs> Tigger hates Namora. My uh, cat hates Namora. I, I might need glide level two or something. Yeah, fine. Right, because, like, when you hit that maximum glide, it's pretty, Riku, you're pretty much. You get stuck. Little Riku got stuck. <laughs> <laughs> Pretty much lose little <laughs> elevation with, with, with the max glide. Yeah. No, I, I need to stop using magic on those guys. Man, I don't even remember this because it's been so long since I've been to the world that never was. I don't even remember this. Holy shit. I remember <laughs> the cutscene where Riku changes back and the Anthem fight, and that's it. I don't remember anything else. <laughs> so you said it's never going to beat Xemnas, right? Or Riku Roxas, right? Uh. I remember that, but it's been a long time since I played the original, but this is the HD remix, and I'm still stuck yeah. on that Roxas fight because my PS3 died. Oh, goodness. Yeah. I thought you got a new one. No, it, my PS3 plays DVDs, it just doesn't play uh, video games or Blu-ray discs. No, it's been... <laughs> it's dying. I no, it's that really, really Blu-ray really discs. strange. I've, Four enemies I've appeared, had that huh? thing since I've, had, I've had that thing since launch, so it's about time it actually I've been the only away. Does this go right into the Xemnas fight? I f it might. I don't know. Ow, you bugger! Look, <laughs> Kyrie. Where did you get here? Hello! Even with <laughs> We're all falling down. Use magnet. <laughs> Hello. Be no end to this. Thanks, Danny. Oh my goodness. Oh, it's private lot. That's a. Uh, that's like um, 0 0.2 levels of uh, amounts. To the rescue! It's, it's no Captain Justice! <laughs> I will be Did anybody see like that like that part in Riku's clothing design? Like the zipper at the bottom of his shirt is up, so you can see his belt. You can see his belly button. <laughs> <laughs> I, also, I also noticed earlier that he has bandages over his left arm, over his left hand. Yeah. Yeah. Implying he's ready. <laughs> well, if it ain't the boat boy king. Oh, that's like nice. Ship? I don't think so. Sora, your majesty, do not forget, when I've destroyed them all, this castle shall be mine. Yeah, good luck with that. Uh, looky here. Opportunities like this don't come along every day, you know. He's staring at his crotch. <laughs> He's looking at the zipper. She... <laughs> Look at my mouth, folks. Yeah. Well, then again, we've seen he can. We we've seen what he can do. Also, the heartless totally would have caught up by now. <laughs> They're doing yeah. What their hearts command. We can't interfere. Even they though just... they're like our enemies. <laughs> we have bigger fish to fry. So... Yeah, because their models disappeared. Yeah. Swiggity swooty. Uh, and the, they 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 they're, they're <laughs> gone if you decide to go back as well. Oh no, it doesn't okay. start right away. Once we get up the staircase, then it's the, then it's the final checkpoint. Yeah. Wait, well, it's first by with this, and then it's the, uh... Where the heart looks? Where the, where the heart looks? Yeah, see, they're just gone. Yeah. But they're I really good. I, I think if I remember correctly, in the original PS2 version, the game kind of tanked in this area. Because it mm. couldn't handle, like, all these little JPEGs running around. <laughs> Oh, you're being that bad. My gummy ship in the original one lagged it. <laughs> yeah, that's like when we saw, saw the uh, gummy ship missions for 
uh, uh, assault the dreadnought. Like, like I was just thinking, like, how would that even run on a normal PS2? Lucky. The, mu <laughs> the music here, the music here is so good. Yeah. Battle uh, PS. <laughs> it's like the music in Unleashed. Except for the battle theme in Unleashed, because that thing just gets stuck in your head and it's repeat. Uh, over, uh, over. Yeah. Stop it! <laughs> <laughs> Best version. Da, 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 oh, goodness. Like, adding another. Da, da, da. <laughs> well, I don't think I told Harry this, but I told Jason that um, in a call yesterday that I found a whole bunch of Game Boy Advance Ninja Turtle games that I actually decided to play them, and because it's early Konami, I. If I get played on easy, I get scolded for not playing on a harder difficulty. Fuck you, Konami. Wee! The source is like, I don't want this to the ground. Yeah. Yeah. You said the whole like Zig like Zigbar does during his or Zaldin says, hey, Zora. Uh -huh. Yeah, he goes, Zora. I don't even get why. <laughs> Hmm. No, I hate those things, by the way. Those particular those things. Right. Yeah, the big one of my favorite personal bodies. I I've never heard. I've I've all I I've never heard someone who's uh, who like that said they likes them. They just, they just love to go into modes where they have like no invent no um yeah. no um no knockback. Yeah. Yeah, like I said, it's best to just take them out as quick, soon as you can. So they can't really do much because as soon as soon as they get the chance to attack you, uh, it's a mess. Yeah. I do have to say, um, I don't know if you guys know this, but I remember in the interviews with the voice actors when Kingdom Hearts 2 actually came out, and the voice actors were asked the question to describe their character in a few words, like Sora. Haley Joel Osment's like Sora's like the happy-go-lucky protagonist. Uh, I don't know who the voice actors for Kyrie or Namine are. They, I, if I see their face, if I saw their faces, I remember them, but I don't actually remember their names on the top of my head. Mm. But um, Kyrie's voice actress is like she's their friend; she'll always wait for them. And Namine's voice actress is like she's Kyrie's ultimate ego. David fucking Gallagher, Riku's voice actor, just straight up said Riku's a sexy guy. <laughs> <laughs> oh my goodness, that's amazing. <laughs> I'm like. I don't, I don't know if that's just as good as this one post where I saw where it described Liam O'Brien's voice as sex for the ears. Yeah, that, that's pretty much Liam O'Brien, and that's why Cat Maddie is confused at Infinite, because she's like, wait, excuse me! Ooh, we can get Save the King. <laughs> nice. Oh, finally. And we can get another yep. Moogle level up. Oh, that shit's freaking Is that a save, is there a Save the King plus? I don't think oh, so. Uh, the check it. Ribbon. <laughs> Ultima weapon? Oh, hi! Uh, <laughs> We're gonna make that eventually. <laughs> yeah, eventually. Hi, Ultima weapon! You We're mean the one boss shot. in Final Fantasy- You mean the one boss in Final Fantasy X that you can actually pay money with with Riku to not actually fight? <laughs> you can do that. that. <laughs> oh, wait, can we- wait, we got- we, It looks like we can. Yeah, if, if if it's on there, then it has to be, because there's no other w reason why they put that there. It's gonna be yeah. The only weapon I think that you can't upgrade is actually say, is actually um Ultima. Yeah, that's hey, fair no, enough. Stop, stop trying, because Ultima would then be fucking broken. That. The yeah. petite rank, we make ribbon. Ooh, we, oh, we can make ribbon. No, stop. Look at all this. <laughs> I remember a ribbon actually being. Oh, we can upgrade the. Can we upgrade the Buster Man? No, no. We already have it. Um. Yeah. I remember ribbons are actually traditionally pretty good accessories in Final Fantasy games, I believe. Yeah. Yeah, ribbon, ribbons are really decent. They can only fit certain genders, actually. But uh, Bart's can wear one in Final Fantasy V. Mm. <laughs> oh. What? I didn't Let even know that before. With his fucking ribbons, okay? Let it be fabulous no, no, with his ribbons. Like, no, I don't know why this funny. Like, yeah. I bet that it's usually gender in like gender specific. And then there's Bart's. <laughs> Bart's defies gender ah, roles. Dang it. I mean, have you seen his dancer outfit? Mm -hmm. It's fabulous. It's 
it's lovely. There are all the mid drifts. Get that DLC outfit. <laughs> oh, I wish it was the thing in, in NT. Because if they got nameless, if they got helmetless warrior of light, which I approve of, 10 out of 10, because I love that hair, it's gorgeous. But give me dead support so I can see abs in HD, please. <laughs> <laughs> what? 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 You, what? Oh yeah, you do. Cause I you never. Know, actually... What? Jack abs aren't enough for you? Come on, where's uh, the thing? I mean, Jack has really nice abs, but he's just, he's just too buff for me. Well, now the channel will finally say that I did the <laughs> did the reaction command. Yeah, I do like playing as Jack, by the way, in NT. Hmm. Yeah, Jack's a heavy hitter. That's pretty much his characteristic. I'm gonna fuck your shit up, pretty much. Yeah. But like my, yeah, but like uh, yeah. the earlier ones, in the earlier ones. Yeah, go Harry. Uh, then I was, well, I was saying this is basically how I usually grind for final. I kind of, kind of go back and forth in, in this, in the castle, pretty much. You have a very fat health bar. I've never seen a health bar that fat before. Well, unless you count um <laughs> the seven health bars in the platinum. Mutants in Manhattan or something. They, the <laughs> oh. have seven health bars. They have seven health bars. I like to point you towards Lingering Will. Well, it's, uh, inter it's interesting because like, it, it looks massive in Kingdom Hearts, but like in terms of like just Final actual Fantasy. Actual health is not that much. Yeah, actual health compared to like Final Fantasies or just like, RPGs yeah, like, in general. Like, like, the but the max health bar we had in one, it was only like maybe 150. Yeah. Like, to be fair though, if he did have, like, the amounts of health you got in a normal RPG, it would, it would just be unfair. I remember- Isn't there, like, this one boss in Final Fantasy XII that has, like, a stupid amount of health? Uh, you are- I'm trying to remember. Yeah, yeah, oh, I, I, I wouldn't- I wouldn't- I wouldn't know. Yeah. There's- there's many oh, bosses like that. Usually, just... They're usually super bosses, or Bahamut. <laughs> it just- you oh. don't actually really know, but, um... Oh, by the way, can you walk? I want to show you my. I want to show you my usual grinding place. Mm -hmm. The uh, the bosses in that in that Ninja Turtle game, they have seven health bars, and it's annoying. And then they go into rampage mode, and you just gonna have to dodge, attack, dodge, attack, dodge, nice. attack. And I'm just like, I'm just like, hey, hey, Bebop, please, oh. like, can you like put the gun down? <laughs> head, to, head to the head to against its tower. Oh right, okay. Yeah, I'm showing off my grinding spot. Oh, that's right over here. Um, head, um, head to the bottom of the tower, it's fine. Yeah. What, is with that, what is with that extra, like, blank square on the menu screen? It's because it's a, it's because it's a, a warp point we haven't accessed since the, since our revisit. Oh, Jesse McCartney. I think, I, I think it's supposed to be the usual spot. Hmm. Maybe, Right. Yeah. Um, do we have Bond of Flame on? Uh... Um, just for grinding's sake, I'd also put on, um, yeah, a, um, um, of Keeper, um, on main. Oh, uh, so it stays out. Oh, right, okay, yeah, I should have done that earlier. Alright, when you head up here, go ahead. This is also a good place to uh, do um, Master as well, as you have the uh, Drive Converse. Yeah. Let's go! The, the music yeah. in Final Mix is just so good. It is. Like, this is the best uh, soundtrack in the series. Like, and the, the one, the, the so one theme that sticks out to me from the original is actually Space Paranoids, and... Hmm. But I love, as much as I love the Final Mix soundtrack, I prefer the original, like, bit, like, bit tune sound of Space look, Paranoids from the original Kingdom Hearts 2. Look at all these flashy effects, dude! <laughs> yeah. I'm a fucking rainbow, fire, fire, bitch! Fire, fire, <laughs> Oh, we only have fire on. Uh, let's change that I, lo I love how you, I love how you were with Riku for, like, five seconds, and you're just like, I gotta go, I'll, go, I'll be back. Yeah, you're still with us. <laughs> hold down the fort! <laughs> Kyrie, hold down the fort! There's not enough room in the gummy ship, jeez. Donald no says no. So, cause screw you. <laughs> yeah, just like in Kingdom Hearts 1. Yeah. Look at- like, Blizzard just wrecks. Like, it doesn't ho- it doesn't home in like, uh, Fire did in Kingdom Hearts 1, but it, uh, can travel, like, through enemies, so. Yeah, I usually gr grind here because there's some pretty weak uh, nobodies, and you can easily just troll through them. Yeah. But I'm just, we're just going up before I grind. Yeah. Better hurry for master with the or final. Yeah. Oh, that, that's the really 
shitty thing about dry forms is that they just chew away your gauge so fast, and I'm just like... Yeah, oh. Final form especially, like, the other ones aren't too bad with that, but... Valor is the slowest. Yeah. Doesn't actually, help... No, wis no, actually, Wisdom's the slowest. Doesn't help on, um... Doesn't help in Final Form, and, and, and like, compared to the other ones at the time, of the dry games at the time, we just get it. At the end of the game. I oh. just realized as well, we have Final Form now, so we have Final Genie. Oh, yeah! <laughs> you start off now. Ah, uh, Genie. We love you. And we miss you, Robin Williams. Even though David Castellaneta okay. is actually doing a pretty good Genie, but I love- I prefer David- I prefer Robin Show Williams. Show off right here. Show off right here. Yeah. We'll find a battle and summon him. Right. Riku's got his hand in his pocket. <laughs> <laughs> All right. <laughs> Make some room. All right. All right. Sonic. Final genie. And a bitty. This one's really good. Yeah. It ends with a bunch of explosions. The drawback. The the drawback to a uh, final genie is that it, it, the limit drains. Uh, trains the summon bar like no one's business, so you don't really want to spam it if you want to keep Genie out for a bit longer. But it is a, it is really good. Yeah, it's it's, a, it's definitely for the bit. If you want the most damage at once, use this. Yeah. I'm really excited for that. I'm really excited for that. Uh, I'm really excited for the aerial summon in Kingdom Hearts 3. Cause that it looks does so look, good. That does look yeah. cool. Okay. Why? It's about time. It's about time she appeared. She, she appeared as a summon because she she's been like three well, two days. Yeah. Well, I understand. It seems like uh, summons are acting more like D links in uh, for, which for, is for which is probably the better choice for them really because D links, if you think about it, they're much better than the actual summon system itself. Um. Well, and but in the case of Earth by Sleep, though, that's only because it's probably only because you you didn't have any of her party members, so it just. Um, I I well, I disagree. Compare uh for like comparing like Birth by like the command deck system to how Kingdom Hearts two, or like the numbered games do it, but like, uh, what what they seem to say in Kingdom Hearts Freeze case is that they affect your combos because like the command deck isn't a thing in free, uh, but that that sounds really interesting because that if that's the case. That could it leave. The, it just gives the gives the summon an extra thing to do instead of just sitting there and you'll never use them. If they, if yeah. they affect your combos and do different effects, then that, it'll give that a leaves... way to actually use them all the time. That yeah, that's what, I like about, that's what I like about the summons in two compared to one. Like, is because they have they have a lot more utility than just yeah. sit, they're not they're not as situational. Yeah, and my if... favorite thing about Pride Lands. My favorite thing about Pride Lands is that. <laughs> Is that what? Hello? Oh. That didn't miss. Is it back? There you go, you dropped. Yeah, I don't know what happened though. <laughs> I, just saw I, just, I just saw Sora and he just looked like he's about to make the biggest mistake of his life. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no, no. Oh, look at the picture. Look at Mikey, look at Michelangelo. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Yeah. Oh wait, oh, my, oh because oh because okay, okay, cause apparently because my, my mobile scout's still a piece of shit out. All I see, I still just see your uh, the Lalafell picture. Oh well, it's Michelangelo now. Yeah. Which way did we come from? Just, the... just Michelangelo, just smirking. 
Uh, what, what are you saying? Because like, the last thing I heard was the one thing, the thing I love about Pride Lands is something. Okay, it, the, it, it's like, oh, Simba's dead. Oh no, he was with us last game. <laughs> that yeah. <laughs> and the one thing I'll say about the summons is, it reminds me of the assists in the Dissidia franchise. Like, better assists uh, yeah. fit certain characters. Like, I'm going, yeah. I usually play as Bart, and I have Terra as my assist. She'll either, depending on, like, what I'm doing, she'll either cast Blizzard or use, like, gravity and fucking, like, Bring it down out of the sky. <laughs> oh, the end of the city just launch me straight to the ground. Yeah, pretty much. It just makes get some stuck in there. It's like a uh, Golbez or the Emperor's traps. Yeah. It pretty much works like that. Yeah. I know that the yeah. can do is um thing is yeah. stab attack. Yeah. Yeah, but and that's and that's equally hilarious because I told Jason this, but uh, Harry, um, mm -hmm. if Air like, I'm, I'm talking about it. Shush. <laughs> <laughs> My thing is, I have relevant. Oh anyway, goodness. As I was saying, if you have Aerith as an assist, which you have to get through very convoluted means, nice. and Sephiroth and Sephiroth um is has a really decent AI, and she's an Aerith this out doing her like assist thing, Sephiroth will go for her straight. She'll just go for her. Because it's a reference. Yeah. Oh and yeah! Then, I forget what that attack is called. He'll use that move that he used to kill her in Final Fantasy VII. Oh. It's like so dark, but it's hilarious. Yeah. Well, I mean, Sephiroth usually does that. Sephiroth's AI is... If I have to, like, give his AI, like, a chance, it's either a crap shoot or it's like you're in you're in the seventh circle of hell. Yeah. <laughs> so it's just, like, a break. break. <laughs> yeah, it's like, Jek it's like Jek's AI. That AI is a piece of shit, and I hate it. Oh, Ooh. man. But, what um... is Bart's... I'm gonna do if you... Uh, I actually don't remember this because I'm always playing as Bart's, but um, nah, I, I don't actually remember. He'll either do uh, Real, a move from Tokyo. Have a room, aim, doesn't he? Pardon? Bill Chaos. He uses um Gavrim, doesn't he? No, he doesn't. He uses uh. Shinryu. He doesn't have an assist. Oh no, I thought he did in his boss fight, huh? No, he doesn't have Gabarin, he has Garland. Oh, Garland, fuck me. Uh... Oh, wrong, correct G, but wrong one! <laughs> <laughs> You're thinking about Piccolo, not, not, not British Gabarin who breaks out of his accent. Goodness. What a in, in, one, in one of the quotes, like, no, it's, it's supposed to say, know this pain, but it actually sounds like, know this paint. <laughs> <laughs> nice. <laughs> And, and anything extra says. Burn my bread. Any, and anything extra says is just like freaking Monda Green. <laughs> oh goodness. Inside your head is the void. I love fire. Uh, <laughs> I haven't what? used extra for NT yet. Yeah, screw this. All I do know about Shantoto in NT is that she fucking scolds Tina's experience. <laughs> <laughs> because they didn't say hello. <laughs> because they didn't say hello. Like, she says, good day, and they're looking for her, and they can't see her, and she's like, I said good day, and they look down, and there she is, and they're like, oh, <laughs> hi, and she's like, youth these days. <laughs> <laughs> nice. Shantoto. Shantoto is queen, and she will fucking kill you. <laughs> And that's why I got her, her and that's why I got you her minion for Christmas. She's my wife. I thought that, I thought that was fresh. She's also my wife. <laughs> so is a road she. Yeah. She's also my wife. Yeah. So what's this? Long life list is like the tiniest list ever, okay? But what the hell? What? Uh, okay, my, my my friend Spar, who um who sent me a Splatoon for my aim one for my birthday a long time ago. Um, uh, yeah, Final Fantasy. Uh, for, uh, before you say anything, Maddie, uh, j just like we're, I'm just no, just understand what I'm saying here. Um, uh, apparently, um, it, Final Fantasy 15 is coming to Steam. If you pre-order it for Steam, you randomly get Gordon Freeman's outfit from Half Life for Noctis. What? 
Okay. That is, that is the stupidest fucking thing I've ever heard in my fucking life. That is Even so more, random. Yeah. <laughs> not just being in, in second seven. Um, I have kitten news. He's under the chair, and this chair's a recliner. He's under the recliner, and his little feet are trying to get my ankles. Stop it! Yeah. You even get a crowbar. <laughs> oh, what even is going on? Yeah, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna grab the picture here, and I'm gonna post it in the, in the Skype chat if I can. Well, I'm really sorry, Final Fantasy 15. I'd give you a chance if your story was an absolute shit and you had a villain who's a complete dickhead and then you rip your female characters like pieces of garbage, so. Ah. <laughs> <laughs> uh, uh. Oh, hi. Oh, hi. Hi, Tigger. Bye, Tigger. Get out from behind the Blu ray! Is the game at least fun? He, she hasn't uh, played. Oh. I haven't played it because I'm waiting for when they actually, you know. Allow me to switch from playing other than Noctis. <laughs> it is. I thought they ever fixed that. Yeah, I thought they did oh, too. No, I, I, don't, I don't know, but if they did, I don't have a PlayStation 4 and I don't have the money to go get the game, so. Yeah. <laughs> okay, okay. Um, I think it's in. Do you see it? Okay, I think I put it in the chat. Do you see it? In the Skype chat. Me or Maddie? Like, what, what man is it? Well, I would, I would, I would have it low. I would have it lowered. Is it loading? Yeah, it's not working. Nope. Fuck it. Skype. Oh, there it is. Wow. <laughs> Can I kill Noctis yet? <laughs> what, Matt, you pause the game, of Harry. Take a look. Alright. Pause the picture of it really quickly. In, in editing? Yeah, it was just why not just, just to see it. Ow, ow. Oh, oh my wow. God, cat, it looks so silly. I, to be fair, though, I do like the glasses. Yeah. My phone fell you can, down. You can still I see. Can, can you? Yeah, I can see. Yeah, but clearly, he's not meant to wear an outfit like that. No, he's not. <laughs> it's funny. Yeah. Uh. Ooh, this might actually be helpful. Now, next thing we need. Next thing we need now is a DLC of um, of um, for um, for uh, Prompto to look like Zaz. Mm. Ugh, please don't ruin Prompto. He's the only other. He's Sorry, like Zaz. one of for the that. other characters that I like. I'm not, I'm not talking about the Lost World Zaz. I'm talking about the one from Final Fantasy 13. <laughs> Or was it Saz? Saz. Oh, my kingdom. Oh, hi! Hi, asshole! Can I have Kara back, please? Okay, thanks. Kara, Jeff Carr. I'll have to start all over again. Warrior Say what you will, man. You have a good voice. <laughs> yeah. Go forth and bring me more hearts. Did I point out? Uh, uh, he no. Has no. Denizens of light. He has brownish goldish this. eyes. Yeah. It's not like bright dark? gold as uh yeah. as that Leonard had, but it's more it's we more brown, it. so yeah. Terra's okay. in there somewhere. Yeah, barely, but still. But the world's made of light and darkness. You can't have one without the other. <laughs> Kylie, why don't you have your key played out? <laughs> oh right. You used Thanks. it once and then you're never gonna sort use it again. Makes you why we are it's going to Aqua and Burp by Sleep like 10 years decided. before. <laughs> then allow me another female person. character! <laughs> Can we put her on? Like, this is why I like Namine anymore. Because Namine does like, shit. It's like Riku and Sora are like, we put our arms down now? <laughs> yes, seriously. By both light and dark. Good lip syncing is good. Yeah. That's when they actually bother, it's actually really it's good. Because you mess up oh yeah, world. totally. Kingdom Hearts, I, I saw that an explanation, it's like Kingdom Hearts is either a However, pixelated JPEG flapping its lips at you, <laughs> or like the best facial have animation have money can buy. Pretty <laughs> much. There's, like, and there's no, like, and there's no like, in between. Like, exist, and animation that we see in games nowadays. Anything. Yeah. <laughs> and this yeah, was like PS2. Like point out that, uh, Nomura has a really strange thing with heroes and having like some kind of blue I in their eyes. Like Ben has blue eyes, Aqua has blue eyes, 
Kyrie has blue eyes, Sora's got blue eyes. The only, ex- the only exceptions are Terra, he's got brown eyes, and Riku's got, uh, I think it's either Aquamarine or it's kind of teal. Samora did the design for 15 as well, didn't he? Uh, I think he did. I think it's it... blue eyes. What? Not does have blue eyes? I'm not sure. I don't really like Noctis, so I don't really care. Like, I, <laughs> I don't uh, care what color the, the, eyes are. Uh, see, yeah, because it seems like the Final Fantasy characters that get in are characters that Namora designed. Well, like, yeah, he, so like he's doing character Squall. design. He's been doing character designs for a while. I know that much. Uh, uh, yeah. yeah, like Squall, Cloud. I Kiba. think he did some character designs in Xenoblade 2. Don't call me on that. 